guys welcome back to my youtube channel today i am showing how we can install komodo antivirus it is a free antivirus and it is one of the best antivirus software available it has two versions one paid version and one free version so you can just google komodo antivirus and you will get a link for antivirus.komodo.com once you click on the antivirus.comodo.com you can see there is two version full version is there free version is there full version it's uh, for one pc dollar 18 per year and for three pcs dollar 20 per year so just click on the free version for us to test and download the installer meanwhile we can just compare the two versions uh, when we compare we can see that the defense and technology auto containment technology and cloud-based antivirus spyware scanning everything is there and in paid version we have firewall web filtering and product support 50 GB online storage backup is there and 10 GB trust connect Wi-Fi sec wi security is there so these are the additional features that we are getting in the full version and but it's paid you have to spend about twenty dollar per year for three devices and for if it's one device you can spend eighteen dollar anyway we will check the installation of uh, the free version it's almost similar to the paid version just i'm gonna try to install the version uh, okay i'm getting some error because i have already installed the antivirus so let me uninstall the antivirus first and I will come back for the installation steps okay now let's start with the installation right click on the antivirus and run as administrator if you are not an administrator account and oh, it's asking for the restart because I just uninstalled the previous version uh, let me restart and come back okay okay run as administrator this time it will work if you are using local account which uh, doesn't have admin privileges you have to run as administrator and give the admin and password okay now just click on the options for us to customize the installation when you click on the custom option you can see there is automatically Komodo Dragon web browser installing I don't need the web browser now just wanna uncheck that one and if it's a paid version you will see the Komodo firewall as well there before it was uh, free even the firewall it was free now they have removed the firewall from uh, the package and it's available only in the paid version so just click on the install after we customize the installation uh, now it's downloading komodo antivirus from the internet because you know it's just 6 mp file it has to download about uh, 230 mb or about more than 100 mb i think so um, let's come back after some time okay now it's finished the installation you can see that there is a lot of option it's given after the installation like change my DNS provider enable cloud-based behavior analysis so I'm checking the I'm checking the last two option sent anonymous program and Yahoo browser as default because I don't need Yahoo as my default home page so only I kept the first two options and uncheck the other two and finish the installation Okay, now we have uh, finished the installation of Komodo. You can see the Komodo icon on the top of uh, in the desktop, and you can see in the system tray as well. Uh, once you open, you can see that uh, it's asking for fix the problem with the Komodo. It's for updating the database. Uh, 300 to 350 MB database will be updated. After that, it will run a scan a security scan on the device so that's how we can install the Komodo antivirus and it's very important that you need to update 
uh, it before scanning whenever you give a scan on uh, Komodo it will go to internet and try to update the um, Komodo for the latest packages available latest patches fixes now I will introduce the options again when you click on the scan you have a different option quick scan full scan writing scan custom scan quick scan mean will be faster but it's not going to deeper custom uh, full scan it will be uh, very slow but it will scan each and every single file and even we can customize the scanning in unblock application we can block and unblock specific application uh, update option is nothing but updating the antivirus to the latest package and you can see there is available for Android uh, version as well for mobile security and anti theft is there backup is there app lock is there you can try the software or I will introduce this in uh, later videos run virtual is a very good feature I liked it with Komodo antivirus it's uh, if you have some program suspicious program you can run it in the background so that's a very cool feature now what is this um, it's going for live support yeah if you if you click on the live support it will go to the website for a chatting with the support now you have we are into uh, we are checking the teams and interfaces you can see that I'm going to change it to Arcadia team for me to have a different experience and show desktop widget is for showing the Komodo in the desktop let's try what is it we can also enable password protection I'm not gonna do that once I press ok you can see that the widget came on the desktop it's just I'm showing this one I just want to remove this one how you can remove right click on this one widget click on show so it will be disappeared in the settings you have other option like updates when you need to update uh, with what frequency it should go for internet and check the updates logging and configuration you have a different option and the antivirus antivirus you have real-time scanning and custom scan real-time scanning is nothing but scanning it whenever there is a threat it will scan in real time and it will find the threat the default option uh, the option for antivirus alert quarantine I'm not gonna change it we can change it if you want and in scans you have option for manual scanning the other stuff so you can have a try on this one which APS I'm not going to enable it and JPS rules rule sets this stuffs we don't need it just we keep it as it is if you want to customize and if you want to study in detail you can check the referrals containment setting is nothing but running the applications inside the container so that it will not interfere the physical computer that's a very good feature you have to try it and auto containment is there automatically it will contain the applications when we are trying to uh, install an application in file writing you have file writing groups file groups file list we can exclude some of the files similarly and advanced production virus scopes scan exclusions if you want to exclude any folders we can add it here suppose you need one folder which is not to be scanned you can do it there device control you can in device control you can block the devices for example if you can if you want to block the USB you can block it and you can block CD drives CD DVD drives USB devices uh, it's up to you I'm just not going to do it I just show it showing them just showing the option click on it and remove for us to make it then the default script analysis uh, script analysis we don't need it that's for managing the applications mainly miscellaneous uh, we don't need it so it's just um, 
if you want to study more you can just go to the Komodo website and you can see how it is working so this is basically the antivirus software guys um, you can try this this is a free software and thank you for watching um, subscribe the channel and click the bell icon for notification bye